Hello, fellow cheap this is Captain Fire 3. In the life is strange. Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! <sighs> Called Phil Whoa. Little Pieces what of Time. What the fuck? But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk to me. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. Don't insult me. Max, go on. Into that point where life is strange. Max? Chloe? This it time on my PS4 because I only had the Welcome first home, chapter Max. on the PC. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Something happened to her. Wait! Is that grass? Tell me the truth. That's an order. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Max, tell me everything. So I haven't played this much. So... Well, I mean... Of course I played the first one on the PC, but now I'm playing it on the PS4 to continue everything because that's the only way I'm going to be able to do it. Okay, we got Max. Damn it, I forgot her name. Okay, hold on. There we go. Oh no, it's going to be weird for me. Just so it doesn't feel weird to me and it's quiet and only talking, you know. Don't nod is don't nod backwards, by the way. I can't skip this. Come on! This is like one of the most boring cutscenes so far. Get out of bed, damn it! Actually, my alarm is set for five o'clock, and it's like this on the uh, uh, the Apple devices. It's like there's one preset one on there called digital. If you have an iPhone or something, or an iPad, whatever, go to the text tones or whatever and look for it. It's called digital. It's annoying. And then I was like, ah, maybe I should wait to record this. Okay, Max, let's hit the showers now. No. Wait, why am I reading that? That makes no sense. Whoa. Hello, zombie <laughs> face. This is what happens when you research quantum physics all night. And that must really suck. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. I don't remember the controls that well. The music was playing on that the whole time. It would be fun to get some peeps together and play a real game instead of drama games. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do, 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 do. Anything else? Sticky note. I can't keep my eyes open, but I know there's a scientific answer. No smile. First, let take me take your power a selfie. Seriously. I took a selfie. Let's see. I should probably water this plant. Drink up. I can bring you back. I hold the power over life itself. I, I s still don't understand why it would have consequences just watering a plant. Do well, not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. But this is like so be on the it, change. Consider it done. No brook here. Okay. Don't care. Forgot how to run. Hold on, let me find that button real quick. Shit, wrong fucking button. Jesus Christ. Oh, hold on. 
I just realized. Uh, R2. Oh, Jesus, it was R2. Fuck. And this looks really dirty. Kate is an early bird. She might be up and gone. One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. Ow! Alyssa, can you stand over there? <laughs> um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. I, I I've saved her what twice, first from a baseball and then from another thing. Uh, I'm still gonna erase that. Okay, showers. This, no, that's the bathroom. Wake up, Max. Juliet is next to me in the <laughs> hall, not her room. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? That's so not cool. I didn't get wasted on camera and get busy with the Vortex Club. Kate's not like that and you know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touché. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. Are you sure? I thought you'd be pissed. Not at you. Okay, go ahead. Part of me was almost disappointed because I built up so much rage. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. Hey, Brooke. Oh, hi, Max. Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? Okay, come on. I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? Come on. I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. Okay, good. Okay, that music was kind of weird. Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria, as usual. Go away! People are leaving! Clearly not a morning person. Oh wait, I shouldn't have started talking to What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, I also the best and biggest news did a few of the day is that Trevor asked me for the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, the PC and At least we're showing our faces different. together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. <laughs> uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a rave. It does sound like fun. Okay, come on. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. Okay, good. Wait, what did it say? Conscious. Okay, I'm not even gonna bother. Because I think I fucked it up or something. Fucked something up, I can't remember. How the hell is she always in the right place at the right time, though? I mean, seriously... I think this was the person I, I thought about, and How she was pregnant. I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. 
I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Okay. I really like the art style. The, I, I never actually complimented it before, but... It may not look super realistic, but it's realistic enough where you think, you know what? The people worked hard on this. Like, look at that one. Okay, maybe not. Now, you know what it looks like? It looks like a, one of those characters from TF2 now because of the water, but it still looks fine, I guess. It looks kind of cartoony now that I think about it. What's up, Kate? School. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yuck! I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Max Selfie thought she was a badass taking that picture. I oh, should've beat her down. I shouldn't have done that. That was so uncool. She's jealous because Mark, Mr. Jefferson, knows I'm going to win the Everyday Heroes contest. He thinks Max is a joke. Come on. I understand you're taking a sour. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to this video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. Come on, I understand. <laughs> Wait, she memorized the link. She memorized the link, probably just so she could do that. <laughs> I like the little chick shirt. I didn't comment on it till now. I just realized how good it was. I better get dressed and go give back Kate's book. Somebody else is taking a shower and I didn't even know it. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Hello? Water? Sorry. I forgot. I... I wish nobody said anything about it. That would have been... That would have been hilarious. I wonder if they actually had some female people on this, doing this, you know? But what does it say? Okay, um... You know. Oh, I wish I could erase that. Because, I mean, if that's really what it looks like... I mean, the tampon dispensers... Oh, shit. I went the wrong way. Oh crap, I forgot her name. Oh, okay. Oh no, somebody trashed my fucking room. <sighs> no fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. No, no, no. First, you're gonna wipe this shit off. Or not, whatever. Ah, oh, book, 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 book. Ta da! I do love a clean room. Very zen. Except for that bullshit graffiti. Okay, where's that book? Okay, I'm gonna no search. Book here. You didn't even search under the papers! Oh. Of course oh, she just spilled soda shit. on Kate's book. Better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to our list of problems. 
Be gone, foul soft drink. I love how she can uh -huh, remember that, but nobody book. else can. You're mine. I mean, it makes sense because she. Yeah, I guess with time travel that makes sense. So. I guess I understand. I need to get dressed before I go there. Oh crap! Oh, uh, get get your. Maybe I'm I wish I could dress her. Jeans. Like, well, I mean. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. <laughs> Imagine knowing the answers to a test. Oh my god. Imagine being able to see the answers now I can for a test. Let me take this back to Kate before I'm late. Uh oh. Oh shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. But you know, this imagine like having reason. able to read one time and then you have all the answers I now. Be doubly careful around Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Matt. Oh my god, I aspire to have a room like this, not only as big, but I mean like, holy shit, look at how clean this room is. I have a smaller room than this, but I mean fucking still, holy shit, oh, oh look, it's a rabbit. <gasps> oh, it's so cute, it, it shouldn't be cute to me, but it is cute, so shut up, please, and thank you. I don't, I don't want to sound rude, so. Especially because I don't want to lose you guys. Okay, let's see. Bible, blah, blah, blah. Oh my god! Oh, hold on. Oh, actually, no. I guess not. Um, hey, Kate. I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Did you party with them? I went to a Vortex Club party against my better judgment. Not my scene at all. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. Okay, pause. This actually happens in real life as well. So... If you're a victim of something like this... You have to tell people, but I mean, this is just one of the things, so be careful when out in a party. Don't take drinks from random strangers. And I have Even if no there's somebody that you know. That's awful. So, how did that happen? It's a long story. I'm still trying to sort it all out. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. So, what next? that's All the kind of thing. All I recall is driving for a long time. And I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck and and are you sure of course you think i'm making this crap up why no i'm just being deductive as usual then what happened that's all i remember i don't know what happened i woke up outside my dorm room the next day 
I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who oh, took no. the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? Yes, you should definitely go to the police, Kate. I totally believe every word you say. Nathan Prescott is truly dangerous. I, I don't know guys, anyone that I use. I will go to the police and also principal. Anything Wells. that I do anyways. Who's my backup you know. witness? They'll have to take us seriously now. Backup witness? Well, I mean, I believe you in everything, but we're still just spoiled punk students to the cops and faculty. I just think we need to be very careful here. Why? Careful of what? Nothing. Except the Prescotts are a powerful family. I hope this won't backfire on us, that's all. Even though that rich bastard has earned some serious bad karma. He'll get it. This... Time out, Max. You actually told Kate to go to the police and the principal. After getting a scary text threat. Now the police will definitely drag you into this shit. Do I care? I don't know if I care enough. I literally don't know if I care enough. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys, and they'll use that against you. Yeah. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Uh, see how... Uh, I told you this is hard to do. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. You know what? I, I can't keep going back and forth. It's hard. It's hard when you have to make a decision, you know. And I don't blame them, but still. Who art thou? Hi, Taylor. Why would you even talk to me after the shit you pulled yesterday with Victoria? I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk for once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Okay. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy, too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you could have. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends, too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. Taylor. Conversation over. Hi, 
Hi, Taylor. Why would you even... I've heard that your mother was sick. I'm so sorry. What, what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Victoria was there for me. Like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. I know. That's why I wanted to talk. I'm glad we did. Hi again, Taylor. Hey, that wasn't such a bad talk. We should do it again. See you later. What are those things are? Hey, Samuel. Wait, who does this guy remind me of? Hello, it looks like Max. a bigger version. Remember, um, the early morning. Peter Dinklage in Underdog. I think it was Peter Dinklage that played in Underdog. I can't remember the the movie. Ah, uh, which one got? That's one thing. Okay, that was creepy. Let's see. Do do do. Now where do I go? Oh look, Max, it's warm. Come on over here. No, fuck you. No, I'm just kidding. I'm over here. Yes, I'm over here. Warren, Speak. What are you doing here? Speak up, Warren. Oof. Come on. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. He sounds, like, he sounds hero. younger you than he actually is. You stood up to a bully is. and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I was too scared to tell Principal Wells. Please, don't say anything. I'll give you more info later. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes <laughs> on. Let's go with that. Yes, that's exactly what I mean. I well, love Didn't I say yes to a party? Well, that was easier Shit. than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. What did I do? Okay, I didn't get this far right here. I didn't get to as far as Warren without quitting, so. Come on, Mary, I can just go. David Wait. talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. True, I mean, uh... There's the bus. I don't know why I chose Banjo. On. Yes, I would like some coffee. And there she is. A lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these yeah. years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But not that smart. Now you get busted for smoking pot. I heard the whole sordid story from David. I'm sorry this was how you had to meet him. He's a good man. No matter what Chloe says. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't even smoke, like, ever. It was almost an accident. It was very stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, it surprised me fierce. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. Sorry, I get I way did. into I these conversations. Really so. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, 
I hope Literally, you see hold on. I have no camera. Needs an old friend again. Joyce, and I never I use the so face cam, you know. I want I to. Great memories of him. But I'm glad literally, I, I was just that about was to show you. To like, Wonderful I waved my hand or whatever, and Even I'm trying Chloe to show you guys again. Yet. God damn it. <sighs> but, you Chloe know. understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> blue hair's now not that bad. Now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I mean, if you're a boy or a man, you know, you? anything like that, He's and not you as have much blue of a hair, as you I mean, think. it can look good on but some you people. you did tell him you had a joint, right? You but took that responsibility? Women can dye their hair and it'll look fine. I did, and I am sorry. I don't want Chloe in any more trouble. Or me. Nobody's in trouble over a doobie, Max. <laughs> I admire that you took the heat for Chloe. Like a great friend. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but I'll stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? I saw him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. So, now let's get down to the nitty-gritty. What do you want to eat? Belgian waffle. The last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Now finish your coffee. I, I like bacon. I don't like omelets. Belgian waffles. One Belgian waffle for the hungry girl, pronto. One Belgian waffle at 12 o'clock. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. Come on. Oh, I thought he was walking to me. He's walking to me, I thought. Oh wait, so, uh, that makes no sense. The lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. Well, you could. I guess I actually can now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Nerd graffiti. Warren must have been here. Oh, nothing else to look at, but... I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. Here, you'll love this. Oh, please tell me it's not that small. I'm drooling like a baby. Oh my god. I still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe... Oh. Mm, speak of the devil. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, Mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she did. Max is a good girl. A woman. She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. Call him <sighs> David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. That's rude. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town? Wait, why would you blow a town that what is this seems shit like a talks? pretty big penis if you ask me? Now that that's out of the way... Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation, and I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. Some... Old chewing gum? Nada. Not impressed. 
Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Ha! Huh. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Keychain, cigarette. 25, 50, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 86. Okay, got it. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max, I'm hella ready. Cigarettes? I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? <gasps> Fucking bitch! Thirteen cigarettes. I smoke too much to have thirteen cigarettes. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you- Great. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully uh, and don't forget anything. One, two, three, four, five, six... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so I wish I could write this down. Hold on. 2550, 7580, 8182, 83, 84, 85, 86. 86 and 7. Okay, got it. 86 and 7. You see how far I have to rewind? Wait for it. So, this is me. Okay, Max. Okay. Keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Uh... A pixel heart keychain. A what? Do you even know me? Okay, psychic girl. Great, I fucked it up again. So it was a panda. Oh shit, hold on. 86 and 7, got it. So, this is... Okay, Max. I'm pretty sure you have. Yes, you know. Seven cigarettes. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Keys. Your car key. Duh. Uh, panda keychain. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Okay, uh, 86. 86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. A parking ticket. You know me well. But, what is the exact time I was busted? 6.42 a.m. I don't even think about getting up that early. Okay, psychic. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't 1034. forget anything. 1034. 86 and 7. So, this is me too. Okay, Max. Parking ticket. A parking ticket. You know me. Uh, 1034. 1034 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time! Even a broken clock is right twice a day. Whatever the hell that means. Your car keys. Duh, wait. Pin the keychain. A cute... Not bad. You do have that. Okay, got it. I'm pretty... Cigarettes. Yes, you know I'm... Seven cigarettes. Seven. <laughs> Super... Amazing. Hmm. Clearly... I... And this was... 86 cents. 86... That's right, live in lock. Amaze balls. I literally just got chills all over my neck. You have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? What is she having? Better than I remembered. 
Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like a wolf. Clearly. I am freaking no, out I'm about hungry. what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something oh, way so cooler, give so me I will food. Oh no, my doubt. Cheetos. I finished all my Cheetos yesterday. I will predict the future. No way. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. The cop drops his glass and Joyce argues with him. So what happens next? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and he quickly exits the diner. I'm concentrating. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor fight I and Joyce beats them. Yes, you still need to tell me one more event, Max. Oops. That is did so wrong. Did you break another cop? Really? I you knew it was a trucker it. after I did the cop. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. You are really whiffing this. I'm waiting for that girl to... That's the best song I've this heard is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So what are you waiting for? Oh, what the fuck just happened? You saw that, right? That was creepy. I'm going to predict. Uh, Trevor drops his glass. Trevor drops his glass. I just fucked and that up. Justin makes fun of him. So what happened? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how the. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Just wait. I fucked up one of them. It was the trucker and not Trevor. Oops. That is Did so wrong. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a oh, dick. You're so Slap cool. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. Come on. Yep, this is the cockroach on the wall. There it is right there. Fucking A. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So what are you waiting for? Okay, let's try this one more time. I'm going to predict. Trucker. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens? And then his partner leaves. The cop. Well, let's. And Drew stops them. Justin and Trevor are. Fine. This is getting. And jukebox the goes jukebox. crazy. Pretty bizarro, man. Oh, so oh wait, really? Go, Mom. No refill Sorry. for you. It's 
stop. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called it. But he's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. I'm, I'm sorry that this boy, video is a little yeah, too long. I'll try to edit it to make it entertaining, the like right now. Whoa, it's going around in a circle. And I just got stuck upside down. Shit. Yes, that's well, what I'm just uh, fix you it and time, done. Max. That's there fucking we go. insane. We have to play. I don't have time. You did not just say that. Actually, after well, an hour, that. Check out your nose. Too much blow. Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again. Then, let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Hopefully this is the end. I'm, I'm just, for each episode, I'm just gonna do one chapter. Hold on, let's check this out. This looks too Coming real. Up at noon, KBA 7 News will explore the mystery of yesterday's un Okay, I don't give a fuck. Let's go. Okay, Supergirl, let's go to my secret place. Don't even answer. We have places to go and what to do. Come on, before mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. I have to answer, there's hey, no Kate. way I can. What's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Wait, why don't we just go back? Oh no, Thanks, because Max. then something if bad will happen. rather chill with Kate, please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now, let's rock. Let's rock and let's roll down the hill just like Sonic. Oh look, it's Sonic across it the sucks screen. That Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. Holy shit! Oh my God, there's a PNG of David Copperfield. I don't know. First thing that came to my head, just trying to impress people. Oh my God, it's Wolf's job. No, I'm just kidding. That's not gonna be put up <laughs> unless you want it to. That's not gonna be a meme for my channel. That was so the thing that came to my head. Keep up. How many times are you going to get pissed at me this week? That depends on you. Oh my god, it's Jim Carrey. Well this phase of the test. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super sized. We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. I'm just gonna add random things throughout this episode for a whole hour David might be a or douche, more. But you did steal his gun. You know, Is like boom. Armed in like Bayonet? at the Only beginning, the it's be. just gonna like, be something dildo. I don't know. Step to low. I'm oh, not Jesus. in the revolution yet, Che. You are the revolution, Max. So we should figure out how to best use and abuse your power with a test. Drink? Yuck! You are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer and guns? <laughs> nice combo. Wow. You can handle it. Now go find us five bottles. Pretty please. Fine, hold on, let me find five bottles. There's no bottle right there. Dilly dee dee doo. Dilly dum dilly dee dee doo dee doo. Oh, gross. So disturbing to see old syringes on the ground. Uh, let's let's go pick it up and get some STDs. Every car has its own tale and history. 
Uh, yeah, but you will never know what the tale is or how it Oh, oh that's thing. They left you here all alone. That's creepy. That is super creepy. Wait, I need, then let me guess. There's gonna be a photo opportunity somewhere. There totally is gonna be a. This looks note. like a graffiti museum for Chloe and Rachel. That kind of hurts. Okay, da 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 da. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. Wait, what? There's makeup? They really were besties. I could Rachel songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. Most likely not. They would have gone all the way to Los Angeles for a rave. Looks fun. LA bitch. Now we're officially a trio. We just have to find Rachel. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I feel like I did something bad. It's like graffiti on graffiti. It's Hello, bottle number one. Four more to go. Ouch. Okay, uh... No photo opportunities in here. Oh, yeah, that's some Rachel mixtape. songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. There's no motto here. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. Uh, that uh, that's not a tip. More like really gross, if you ask me. Not gonna leave quite yet, but you know. I don't want to go that way. Oh, whatever. You know what we can do? If I could have been on the track at that right time in the- Oh my Jesus, shut no, up! I don't want to go there. Why did I go that way again? This must be annoying. Oh, that must be very annoying. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? Huh. I could use this board as a bridge. Why is Doesn't that? Oh no, heavy. that's grass. I thought that was like a face or whatever. I bet I could get on the boat from a higher location. Okay, I see where I'm going. Those shells look fresh. Okay, maybe the bottles just pop up whenever you get in the- Oh, oh, I lied. I fucking lied. Stupid bottle. So it's still broken it is. Let's see. Oh, there's a crate to move. Okay. I was like, I thought we were going to open it. Then I saw that it said move. Then I was like, what? Boom. Only three bottles left. Okay, let's fix it. I wonder how many generations of fashion went You know what that reminds me of? Because it's open like that, it reminds me of the, um, uh, Harry Potter Chamber Secrets game for the PS2, I think. Which I really want to get. Um, uh, I used to play it. It was, it was a real fun game. I really like wow, Harry sir. Potter. That looks exactly like the same dough from my tornado vision. What is that? Wait, it's not- is That dough is the perfect photo op. Wait, where is it? Where the fuck are you? Wait, imagine it's not even there. It's not even gonna be in the photo because look at it. It doesn't even look like it's there in the first place. Hold on. It's not even in the picture. It just disappeared. See what I said? 
It is her spirit animal, yes. This was an old school punk shirt. When she looks at all these smashed up cars. <laughs> Why did you say that? Three down, two more to go. Oh Talk yeah, the... finding a bottle in a haystack. Hold on. I know where the other one is. Where's that boat? Where's that boat? There's the boat. There, there, there's the boat. Uh, where's the baby? Where's my baby? Sorry, that. Way heavier than I thought. Ugh. Way heavier. Shut up. You lifted that up. You lifted that up. In one go. Oh my. The Bigfoots were here. Jesus. Poor football. Oh my god, it's a squirrel. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna go get that. No, there's nothing else to look at. Let's go over here. Okay, I can't fall off. That's good. One more bottle to go. Imagine she just falls backward. Although this backward. junkyard is a dive, I see why Chloe hangs here. I mean, I wouldn't hang She's there, I guess, but... Steampunk? It actually feels like Chloe and I are kids again. We're hiding you mean like, the um... Future. Like steampunk? Like, um... Despite all the like that robot bullshit, from, uh, Treasure Planet. So giddy hanging out with her again. I forgot his name. Bob? No, it's not Bob. Like we've both gone back and Oh, I can't remember. It'll be up on the screen anyways, so. Good, I got up. I didn't know if I could get up because it was in one. Ah, I wish I had enough money. I'd buy an editor, but I guess it's better to edit videos on your own. Unless you have to do a lot of videos. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around Oh, shut the fuck up. I know that. Was it up here? Oh, yeah, it was, I think. Oh, no, it wasn't. There's a squirrel right there, but that's because I, I... I almost wanted to take out a gun and shoot that squirrel for some reason. I don't understand why. Maybe because of other video games? For instance, uh... Fucking Until Dawn, or whatever. Maybe this is the bonfire area. Wait, this... Oh! Oh, there it is! Oh, the smoke, it saved me. What the fuck? I'm sure this is a popular party pit. That scared me. Finally. Wow. Now I can deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. I must have passed her or something. Oh my god, I passed her. Thanks, Max. That was only one bottle, and now she has all four. Oh no, there they are. Wait, one more for the road? You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Show me the way, Max. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Nice. Oh, yes! Did you see that shit, Max? Duh. That was so fucking cool. Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Pull the trigger. Now, Max, where do I aim? Aim slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative here.
Give me something to shoot, Max. Aim at that old blue plank here. I hate old planks. Aim at that old blue plank here. I hate old planks. Yawn. Give me some. Let's see you take a crack at that rusty barrel. Sorry, Mr. Barrel. Your time has come. Bam! Oh, Look Jesus. Those fat bullet beats. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? Hella yes! Did you see that? Nice shooting, Tex. Now that that's was cool. What I'm it bounced about. off and then like. Satisfied? <laughs> like, never? So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target now? Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Put a real dent in that front bumper. Goodbye, cruel bumper. <laughs> Jesus, I shot myself! Ah, I shot myself! Back up, back Stupid up! Stupid gun! Hold on, Chloe. Oh my god! Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Let's see what happens when you shoot the gas tank. Step back, gas tank go boom. <laughs> boom! Car definitely down, but no bottle casualties. Holy shit though, imagine... Dude, I need a target before I shoot. I want to see that windshield go down. Watch out for flying glass! Run. You guys better run for cover! Yet the bottle remains. There's something wrong. As I keep doing this, she gets all I am spinning wheel of death. She's gonna shoot herself, please. Oh my god! That's hilarious. Took out all of the rest of the bottles. Uber cool. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. I don't know. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max. <laughs> Jesus, that's not only allowed, but my room is dark right now. That was scary. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? A little. Thanks for helping me. Just... Give me a minute. One. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. I'm glad I feel normal again. I better go chat up Chloe. Okay. Looks like you're ready to lock and load. I knew I it. Just like this. a lot of people with superpowers, for instance, um, there was this oh, one old movie, I forgot what it was called. I know you like, they would all use their powers or whatever, but they'd still get a bloody proud, nose. Uh-oh. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute when you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. 
In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? Come on, point the gun at him. Please. Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. That is hilarious. Oh, man. I'll remember you, kid. I'll remember you almost shot me. And you'll wish I had no memory, because I never forget. Come you have until Friday that. to pay me. Don't ever pull crap like this again. It'll be the last time you do. Try bullets next time, brainiacs. Sorry. You are awesome. Thanks for standing up for me. Maybe I'll keep this. I will totally keep this. But I may die. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Jesus, I almost shot this guy. And now he'll be more dangerous to Chloe and me. If you put it like that, then yeah. I'm getting a seizure just from looking at that. Oh, well, I feel like I am, but not really. Are you ready to do this? We should jet before. We have plenty of time to do anything we want, whenever we want. Make me proud, sister. Oh, come on. Come on, girly. Shoot me. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Thanks. You have until Friday to pay me, or I'll track you down with this interest. That have a stupid. good play, kids. You really stood your ground. I freaked. I don't like guns. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step shit will have his other gun sealed in an electrified bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held a gun on a human being before. Not cool. I know, Max. Really. I'm actually relieved it worked out this way instead. And there are more guns out there. Come on. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Oh, man. Frank took Chloe's gun because of me. Come on. Are you ready to do it? Come on. Good, now I gotta get out of here. You know what, this has gone on long enough. If you like this video, leave a like, comment down below. If you wanna see more uh, in what you want me to do next, subscribe if you're new and may the odds be ever in your favor. Goodbye.